Hello and welcome to this second video about program 55. If you've not seen the first video then I suggest that you would probably want to look at that first before watching this video. So I had some customer requests to make some modifications to the original program and I thought that uh, it was worth producing a new version. Specifically what I was asked to do is add some labels as you can see on this chart under the lines and towards the right of the screen which described the value of the line. The other thing I was asked to do is make it so that it was possible to modify the type of line. So you can see here we've got various dots and dashes and so forth. And uh, they are the two principal changes. You can also modify the font of these labels and the size of those labels. So let me just go into the analysis technique and we'll just quickly go through the inputs. Now, as I say, if you've not seen the first video, you probably want to look at that first because I explain most of these. But the new ones come down a little bit lower down the screen where we have the line styles. And you'll see here that these can be set between uh, 0 and 6. And let's just change that to 6. And you can also change the font name and also the font size. I'm just going to change that to say 10 and line thickness stays the same update frequency that was available in the previous version and then the final input draw labels if this is if this is set to true then we see those labels if it's set to false we don't see the labels which is how the previous version works so i'm going to say okay and go back and uh, line one style that will be the red line and you can see now we've got number six and I'm going to uh, with this new version in fact with the download I'm going to include both versions I'm also going to include a PDF user guide and so you can read more about these features there and check out the rest of this page because I'm going to add some more information about this new version including uh, a key for the different types of line styles that you can choose. Anyway, I hope uh, you'll find this useful. 